Well, just about seven years after being rescued at sea off the coast of New England, Nathan Carmen will now learn his fate this coming October when he goes on trial for allegedly killing his mother at sea in order to inherit his family's estate. Nathan Carmen appeared here at the U.S. Federal Courthouse in Rutland Tuesday afternoon, nine months after pleading not guilty to multiple fraud charges and a first degree murder charge. Prosecutors say when Carmen was at sea with his mother back in 2016, he had altered the boat to make it more likely to sink. Carmen, on the other hand, argues against that. Another recent development in this case happened just about two weeks ago when Carmen demanded the federal jury minutes that led to his indictment last year. Along with picking a trial date today, Carmen's attorneys and federal prosecutors argued whether his defense should have access to those documents ahead of the trial. Carmen's attorneys argued they want to make sense of the indictment in order to best make a defense and want to know how the government presented information to the grand jury before Carmen was indicted. They want to make sure Carmen's rights are protected and and that all information is clear and precise before a decision on a potential life sentence is made. Prosecutors argued there should be no confusion and that no information is being kept a mystery from the defense. And attorneys from both sides along with the judge agreed on trial dates running from October 2nd to October 20th, meaning that the trial will be just about two and a half weeks long this coming fall. Reporting in Rutland, I'm Matt Holderman. Back to you.